Alright, yo, this is Killer Man coming at you with a uh, video update basically on Save the World for playing 11 months in one day, basically. Uh, it's 3, uh, 336 out of 365, you know. But, um, 11 months. I figured today would have been a better day because I get a thousand V Bucks for the video, right? You know, collect that. You know it. Alright. Let's go ahead and look at the quest so I can show you guys where I'm at 11 months in. It's not the best. I still got a lot to do. But my main quests are done. So this is where I'm at with this. 2 out of 10 for the weekly. What is today? Uh, today is Friday, June 21st, 2019. Okay, so two days after the reset. Only got two of those missions done. If you guys care or not, done none of the dailies. By the way, these are the dailies. You should pause it if you want to read what they are. Um, and this is what I have gotten done and what I haven't gotten done. If you don't see a banner, it's because I have done those, I guess. The ones that I do have a banner, obviously, I still need to do. Those are repeatable quest I ne have yet to do the endurance mode or never do the endurance mode because I think the rewards are a joke I've also heard somebody else say that as well I agree with them <coughs> and that's it everything else is done so let's go ahead and check this out also my heroes I'm going to show you guys how many heroes I have um, leveled up 130 and whatnot. I'm going to start with the soldiers. So I have one row, two, three, three rows for sure complete. I could do more if I like. I'll show you guys how much resources I have left over. I mean, like, that I haven't used yet. Um, I have one, two, three, four, four rows. One, two, three, three rows. I should probably uh, go through the heroes real quick individually. Hold on, my bad. Right here. You see the name. I'll even make it bigger, actually. Okay. Quick draw. Calamity. She was cool and uh, never really used her. She's just cool looking, I think. This guy, too. Probably going a little too slow. Let's speed this up. If you guys want to read the name, pause the video. That's what I recommend. I because I felt like I was going a little too slow right there. And I'm pretty sure people don't want to stick around and sit there for a long time looking at this. Uh, me going really slow. So hopefully you guys can pause it fast enough. trying to do a quick overview of what I have leveled up or just what I have in general just to show you my progression from uh, me buying I started with the $20 uh, just a standard edition save the world and then I upgraded to the ultimate later down the road uh, not too far down it was like probably week or two yeah a uh, week or two um, these are my defenders that I have that are assault rifles with the perks that they have that I have leveled up same thing with this the two that I have leveled up um, I have others two that I have leveled up I know probably one I don't like yeah the fire rate just what I had at the time my first one or whatever same thing here, fire rate. That was just because my first one. Mainly is when I use the snipers. There's three that I like the most. The one that does not have fire rate. Uh, I guess this one right here. The one in the middle is the one I don't like, but the other ones I do. 
so that's that I'll tell you guys right now if you guys are looking for ever ever looking for materials watch my expeditions video if not you probably seen one already from another youtuber okay um, so here are my schematics I'm gonna start with the uh, guns <coughs> I got each element bazooka except physical I use energy primarily energy because it's universal I can use it on everything and anything these are the perks that I have each weapon I'm gonna make it bigger like I did with the other one these are the perks that I have for each weapon the perks that I like to use I would do double crit but I don't know you're not always guaranteed a crit and I feel like uh, just might as well just go with one each especially when you use an obliterator right and like say I'm using a level 82 obliterator just to save resources and I want to knock down buildings and stuff um, having the damage perk is better than having double crit uh, just because you would have to put two shots in a say a wall instead of one or maybe three or four depending on what high, how high of a level you are in twine um, yeah my bad let me continue to go forward so as you've seen by the way every 130 is uh, orange perks all the 106s and lower are blue and lower like I said pause it if I was going too fast that's it but I can still show you all the weapons that I have that I still have yet to level up and I'm only going to show you the gold ones I'm not going to go through the purple I'm going to skip really fast over the purple ones like really quickly also if you ever actually want to see any of my schematics you can go to stormshield.one look my profile up killer mean bring that up real quick right there pause it anyway um that you can go ahead and use that particular name right in the epic id for stormshield.one and you can look me up and you can look at all these schematics and actually even the updated ones like after this video um if i change like if i so happen to even want to uh, do this terminator right here with affliction and you wouldn't know after the video well the way that you can know that it, when i do do it just go to the website same thing with a triple tab trash cannon tiny instrument of death any of those yeah tsunami i could easily upgrade them later down the road and uh without having to watch a video you can actually just go ahead and um, go to storm show that one like i said i'm skipping on these purples uh a lot of purples these are my extras right here that I'm probably going to have to make crystal weapons or put them in the book. Probably, I think, crystal weapons. Yeah, all these. Okay, melee weapons. These are my rolls that I like to use. And you know what's messed up today? I seen a video, or yesterday I seen a video. Never have I ever seen anybody anybody use like this combination right this combination of perks until yesterday because I've been giving my weapon out this this weapon right here because I've been giving this one out I feel like it influenced other people and the, the word of mouth got out now I see it everywhere I don't have very many uh uh, melee weapons leveled up as you can see mainly use guns and the one melee weapon I do use is just the one really Like I said if I'm going too fast, hopefully you guys can pause it. I'm not trying to make this video extra long I am trying to talk to you guys. Hopefully keep you guys entertained to keep watching as well as It's just not being quiet in the video, I guess just straight silence Um that's it see I, I didn't really have much uh, melee weapons to, uh, leveled up as well as uh, as a big collection I don't think I don't feel like I do it's pretty it's pretty cool it's not that bad definitely have uh, multiples uh, that I can get rid of and stuff and then my traps these are the traps that I oh my god I recommend you if you're a beginner player or whatever <laughs> I'm telling you right now you need a gas trap nice you don't need okay don't need 
but it is nice to have. Okay. If not, okay, this is the most expensive trap, uh, ceiling trap in the game. Ceiling gas trap is the most expensive. Ceiling electric field is the cheapest. And I recommend you have both of them for ceiling that you start out with. After that, recommend wooden floor spikes with wall launchers. Uh, oh wait, that was a floor and wall shit. Okay, well, okay, those two ceiling and uh, one one floor. Uh, where's another floor? And okay, these two floors. Okay. And uh, a launcher. Cause you're always gonna have to. You're always gonna use a launcher, but trust me. Uh, and possibly it's gotta be between darts and dynamos. I say dynamos are cheaper than darts, so I would want to tell you to get dynamos. So, you want these two ceilings right away. You want these two floors. You want these two walls. And that's your starter. You want to just start with those. Here, uh, By the way, these are my perks. I like to choose one of each. And in this case, since um, I haven't been playing like in endurance mode or war games, I go for increased building health because I figure, hey, what do I, what do I need um, their ability for? Uh, but except that one, because it doesn't really affect my gameplay. Like how um, if a tank blows up, like it's too high up in the air. That's why I have this one, their ability. It's 34 with their ability. Not very many uh, uses. This one, uh, increased building health, effect duration. That's how many times it ticks. I only think it gives like an extra like one tick or uh, shit, my bad. Uh, one each, like I said, one per each. Uh, this, uh, campfire, uh, I think I need to, I think I need to do another healing amount. Because it's not enough. It's, it's honestly not enough. But if you use four in a row, it feels pretty decent. But I think it's still not enough. Um, matter of fact, I think I might change that right now. Uh, healing amount, healing amount. It's gotta be healing amount, yeah. Cause I don't want reload speed. Yeah, uh, one of each again. Uh, I, I honestly, I never used this, so I don't know. Cause especially that the update came out where impact and knockback don't matter for a free strap. I haven't changed it. <coughs> These I have double. I, I don't. Me personally, I like double reload speed and putting it in front of the objective uh, even though I know uh, for like frost knight and stuff like that having all in uh, knockback and impact flying them into the air gives a massive damage massive massive damage these I don't even use really I mean I have and they work really well especially with increased building health um, when you put a ramp in front of the objective and put that platform there you can get health as well as give the ramp more health or even the pyramid if you just do the two front squares and do a ramp style I'm telling you I'm telling you helps with the objective because yeah you could you could put one of these retractable floor spikes but it'd be it'd be useless it'd be useless anyway uh yeah these are my perks damn I, I was all over the place um Let's just go ahead and just pause it if you wanted to see any of those. Let's move on to the next thing. That's what my backpack's looking like. Okay. Like I said, just pause it anytime. If you don't see something right away. Like, um, I mean, like I switch it right away. I mean, so you can just pause it. Boom. I've been using a lot of resources recently or else I would be full or I would have all these traps like maxed out like see how it's odd numbers and stuff like that and recently since the this had um, endurance mode had came by I've been collecting a lot of resources so I can start building up something real nice I want to go ahead and start with traps got them stacked durability for like war games and stuff I knew I was gonna need that or SSDs um, same thing with a lot of like I said materials bright core sunbeam efficient sleek you know 
I got I got some stuff put away. My collection book. I'm missing two heroes and my soldiers. Two heroes and my constructors. Two heroes and my ninjas. Two outlanders. <sighs> and my collection book. I got everything filled out here. I could probably fill out everything here. Just don't do it. Same thing. Oh, I did do this one. Same. No, not same thing here. I had no damn why I haven't collected every single one of them. I got a few though. I got a few. Uh, range weapons. You know. It's pretty nice, right? I'm trying. I'm trying. You know. Uh, it's not perfect. It's not everything's all checked out, but I'm, I'm getting there. I'm trying. I could do it. Like, I have a lot of stuff I haven't got to doing because I feel like it's boring. Like, me making this video alone is basically stopping progression, but I do want to give an update, you know? I want to show you my progression that I have made over time while I was able to play, when I was able to play. And... Here and there, I got like some crystal weapons slotted in and some not. Yeah, like there, see? Like, I, I, I've been working on it. I've been trying to. Because uh, uh, especially when the full year comes up, like if you guys like this video and not like hit the like, but if you guys end up watching it, like I get a lot of views on it, I'm going to end up posting, obviously, my year. I might just do it anyway. My year update to how... I've been playing since uh, birthday, and I will have birthday llamas um, as a video as well. So yeah, as you see, I have all my traps, except this one. Whoa, this one just came out though. Just remember that. Just remember that. I don't. I don't have this one in because this one just came out, and I still need to get those. All right, so I have everything here except I can't get a copy of this one, or else I would put it in the collection book same thing here I got all of those I had copies of those so I put them in to him as well I had copies except those two same thing with them same thing with them if I if I were to have copies I would slot them in yeah, I would, I would definitely slot them in, but, yep, that's, I got the jackal launcher, that's how you get the jackal launcher, if you don't know, you gotta do all these, right here on this last one, there we go, and I was lucky enough, see, uh, during the birthday event, I was lucky enough to fill these in, right, right, and I, and I got, no, this one, yeah, I was able to fill these in, right, and I got this. I've had this since birthday event. Like, what's up? Uh, I'm missing. I have one of the like one of these guys, one of him, right? But I don't have a copy. I can't put him in the book. I had a copy of her since birthday. Got her in the shop. Put her in the book. This guy, I got him. I don't have a copy. Same thing with Archeolo Jess and um, 8 bit. Had since birthday. Military didn't have a copy of her, so I didn't put her in the book. No copies of any of these. Calamity. Event schematics. I still gotta slot some in. I can't put that one in. Oh, yeah, I can. Oh, shit. Well, as you can see, I'm going to try to make this faster because this is feeling really long. And I'm, I want you guys to see everything. And I don't want to make it really short, like um, uh, fly through everything really fast. That's what I'm getting at. I had an extra bowler. That's crazy. I don't remember having two. Anyway, as you can see, like I, I'm, I've been saying, you know, I'm trying to make this fast but I don't want to fly right through it so you guys don't get to see none of it 
So, bear with me. Damn, I'm surprised too. As, like a lot of these are not even filled in, and I need to fill them in. I can fill them in if I'd like to. I have a few of these here and there, like just copies. Um, damn. Yeah, I have a lot to fill in. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. All right, all right, and now transform these are the things I have in case you're curious um, these are permanent this is for upgrading to I think ultimate if not limited edition uh, they help you a lot by the way that's how I got uh, you know really up there entwined really fast because I was able to make my own survivors when I wanted to it just took I guess 50 people I guess and uh yeah it was really it was really quick and easy uh what else is there to show you resources resources there we go i got i use a lot of flux for this sci-fi llama so i could fill in the book so i could start saving tickets as you see at five thousand so look at i got legendary perk of nine thousand you know two legendary troll stash llama tokens uh i don't know what the difference is from there and what i'm about to show you but um you'll see what I mean when I uh, when I go to it I don't know what the difference is exactly but you'll see exactly what I mean I still got all seven of my vouchers got 47,000 uh, gold 49 mini llamas I need to open those for more gold and yeah like it, see like all that stuff is this don't tell me what's stack inside. it out because I don't I need it, it and okay so these are the two tokens right here okay just so you guys see right but I have one here another one about here another one here and another one here and I think the last one down here somewhere yep so I was like I have so many troll stash llamas like I'm ready start opening these if I can get some views on this video I, I mean, like, I'm gonna record it anyways and post it. I don't know what to like title it. 140 llama opening with like no 100 and 100 plus upgrade llamas and like I don't know fucking five, six, seven. I don't know like legendary troll stash llamas, like six of them. Uh, yo, it's gonna be one long video like this one was. I'm, my bad, this one took so long. I try to show you oh my survivors my survivors I didn't show you that okay these are my squads now if you guys want to copy what I did go ahead and do so if not you get the general idea these are my lead survivors these look at all these mythic I, mythics I have that's what I was saying I have a lot of them yeah I do have a copy I could put this guy in the book Yep. So like I was saying, I have a lot of these, but I don't have all of them, especially not all of them for the book. I have a lot of survivors. I recommend you save all the survivors you can save before putting in the book so you can make all the combinations possible just like I did down here for the bonuses. Um, all my upgrades are done. Highly recommend going for the uh, hover turn if you haven't already. If you're a new player, in the heels or the slow field. Or okay, these four right here, these two right here, or these two right here. Highly recommend if you haven't upgraded. And then backpack space is important, especially with storm shield bolt. Or I'll just say backpack size and anything else is up to you. Like whatever sounds like uh, your place are what you need. Oh, 42 also, 600 is the max at the bottom. I think it's like 110 or 120. It's like over a level 100 uh, max level. Um, profile. 
I don't know what to tell you other than I'm what 310 max level and I keep getting stuff I'm, I reached the max level I don't know what else to show you guys I think this is the end of the video right here uh, so yeah if you guys like this kind of video or if I did something really like wrong for this type of video let me know what I did wrong hit the thumbs down and write a comment what I did wrong you know what I mean I don't know I'm kind of still new to this kind of thing and, and normally I would not try to make it this long but I try to show you everything and try to be as brief as possible all right well anyways yo this killer me coming at you with a video for the 11 month update 30 more days I will do another video for 365 with the birthday llamas and all that good stuff but yo 336 days